Once we've determined where we're going to check the tree, we've already identified the cavity. We want to drill into it from the opposite side, not directly into the cavity, but we want to see how far that decay has traveled and how much holding wood we still have present. So we're going to now drill it with the resistograph and see what kind of results we get. Okay, the results of this particular drilling here show us that we have about five inches of sound wood on this side of the tree, and then it kind of drops off and we lose resistance, indicating we have some decay present. But since this is such a large tree, we cannot just determine what the results are from one drilling. We're going to have to take multiple drillings from opposite sides of the tree. These are some of the techniques we'll learn at the Hazard Tree Identification course, and I hope you'll join us and learn more at Rutgers.